Hello, it is I again, David, back with another reaction to Doll's Box. You guys have been asking for this since Hanabie, I believe. And last week when I was reading comments on my uh, Love Bites video, someone said that you do pronounce the stylized S, so Doll's Box. I was confused. I didn't know if it was Doll Box or if it was pronounced like Kesha. It is pronounced. So here we are laden with knowledge and we're going to get straight into the ding dang thing i almost pushed my stop recording button that would have been disastrous Ooh. Ooh. okay so we got a little bit of like an electronic new metal sort of vibe Ooh, i like that Uh, double base. Yeah. That's really cool. Okay. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. So much happening. Sorry to pause it, but I want to talk about what I experienced. This was crazy <laughs> to start. So we've got like an electronic sort of industrial new metal sort of vibe not quite it's still like more on the rock end of things but still electronic and sort of new metally industrial you know what i mean and then we get this nasty scream from i think the drummer and then the lead vocalist has more of like a theatrical like straight stage theater sort of voice she has a lot of vibrato and it's full chest projected tone. I love it. I absolutely love it. And okay, also the bassist is nuts. The bass line is crazy. And I don't know how she's gonna keep that up for the whole song, but I'm sure she will because all of these Japanese metal musicians are nuts. I, I, let's get back into it, sorry. I love her voice. That bass line is so good. This is so good. And that bass line isn't letting up. That's a killer chorus, too. This video is really good, too. And that scream. Yo, that's a cool shot. I like how they're, I like this shot a lot. Like they're, it's not actually frozen. They're just, just standing still. I mean, you obviously know it's not actually frozen. I mean, they didn't pause the video. They're like actually standing still and taking the shot, not just freeze framing. This basis. That one, that one, her, I love her. She has the, like the, like the don't, like she knows she's good. And every shot in the video so far, she's just been like really uh, like stone faced. She's, she just knows she's good. She doesn't have to be, she doesn't have to over emote to like get the point across that she knows what he's, she's doing.
What are we getting? Is it a breakdown or a solo? Breakdown? No. Yeah, get it! This reminds me of like an Alter Bridge solo. This is super good. This is like a Miles Kennedy sort of stuff. It's really good. Oh, I can't get over her voice and the bass. Ah, oh, the scream. So low. So powerful and deep. Yo. All right. Man, this song was nuts. This is crazy. There's so much going on in this song. Like, I can't really nail down a genre. I guess it's like, I mean, it's hard rock metal, but there's like elements of jazz. Like where, like how the, the solo before the last choruses the solo was like it reminded me of Alter Bridge, like like a faster version of like something Miles Kennedy would write for uh Alter Bridge. His solos are kinda of, have that kind of southern rock sort of tone to them, but with a hard rock played in more of a hard rock style. I really love that. And the kind of jazz influence that I was talking about is because that solo didn't quite resolve. There's still like another another beat left and it stopped and went back into the chorus. I actually really like that. It's a cool musical choice. And then there's like industrial and new metal and kind of like pop punk a little bit with the speed like the tempo and the bass kind of reminded me of like a newfound glory sort of bass tempo. But the bass line was more jazz it is super cool there's a lot going on a lot to unpack and like their image is more kind of gothic glam art rock almost with the flowing leather and the lace that's really cool i like all of this i like this so much this is probably my favorite one to have experienced for the first time because the rest of them have like reference points for me this one is just such a conglomeration of things that I like, and it hit me in a new place. Like, I, I'm so glad I got to experience this for the first time. This is a very, really cool thing to experience. And I love the video, too. The vignette shots with the, with the spotlight on them and the feathered uh, vignette around them with the push zoom, and then the shot where they're all where the camera's on a dolly and they're all frozen while they're still singing. That's actually super cool. Man, this was a lot of fun. I love this. I uh, I really like that. I'm going to have to listen to this like five or six more times and listen to specific parts of it to really encapsulate the different genres that they blended here. It's really interesting. And I'm going to be listening to more of their stuff. Obviously, I've been listening to so much like Nemophila and Hanabie and Love Bites and Band Made. S such good music coming out of Japan. Love it. Uh, thank you for watching. And since my last video, I've gotten like another 100 subscribers and I'm over 23,000 total channel views, which is absolutely stupid. And... Uh, you guys have been showing some love on that spirit box cover that I did. So I'm really 
appreciative of all that. I uh, am having so much fun doing this. I can't wait to get into the live versions of all these. That's what's coming next. I'm going to be doing live performance reviews and reactions for all of these bands. So look forward to that. I know I am. And uh, I'll be soon... Oh, speaking of Alter Bridge, I'll be doing a vocal... I'll be doing the vocals for an international Alter Bridge cover project that will be releasing a video in the next couple of weeks. So if you search Alter Bridge Collaboration Project on YouTube, subscribe to them. That's where the video will come out. And then when it comes out, I'll post about it and mention it in the next video that I do afterward. So yeah, super excited. And I'm going to do another Spirit Box cover soon of Blessed Be. It's going to be nuts. I have laid down the main vocals and they turned out really good. So I'm going to go in and do the harmonies and everything later. But thank you for watching. As always, I really appreciate it. I love responding to all the comments and talking to everybody. I still respond to every comment that I get. I'm going to do that for as long as humanly possible. And once again, just thank you so much. It's been a ride so far. I can't wait to hear more. And I love you guys. Bye-bye.